The reality is you don't need millions of subscribers to make good money from social media. In fact, this YouTube channel makes six figures per year, even though it has less than 10,000 subscribers at the time of this video. And the reason that's possible is because number one, you have to have good strategy, which if you wanna see the exact strategy that I use, you can check that out in my free school community. I'll have that linked down in the description below. But number two, you also have to have the proper social media automation tools. So here are my top seven YouTube automation tools that will get you more views, leads, and customers from your YouTube channel. This is basically what I use to take my long form videos and transform those into many short form videos that I can use on all the short form platforms like TikTok, Instagram Reels, and so on. So for example, if I were to take one of my long form podcasts, I'll just click on this one, for example, and then I'm gonna take the URL from right here. I'm gonna copy that. All I have to do is basically paste the link into the tool right here. And then I'm just gonna come down and choose, you know, the style or the template. And so I'll just choose this one right here. And then I just need to choose the length of how long I want these videos to be. So I'll generally choose 30 to 60 seconds or, you know, 30 seconds or less. And that's basically all I have to do. And then from there, I'm just gonna come up, click this button. And now we can see it's gonna go ahead and start editing the video and creating a bunch of short form content. As we can see here, it's estimating it's gonna take about seven minutes. So I will go ahead and fast forward past this part. And so from here, now I have all of these short form videos that I can use. I'll just go ahead and play a second of this one so we can check it out. What is your biggest dream? My biggest dream, you know, I think my biggest dream is just to be able to be, just to be happy. Okay, so you get the idea. And as we can see, it's basically using AI to, you know, choose the most relevant sections of this podcast and convert those into short form videos that I can use, which by the way, every single tool that I'm gonna be talking about on this video, you can find a link for that down in the description below. This is a tool that will basically handle all of your content repurposing on complete autopilot. So if we're talking about the previous example with the podcast, essentially what I would do here is publish a video podcast onto the YouTube channel. From there, I'm gonna take the video podcast and I'm gonna put it into the clipping tool. And then from there, I'm simply going to choose all of the short form videos that I want. And I'm simply going to drop all of those videos into a Google Drive folder. And from there, the repurposing software is going to start distributing all of those videos onto all of the various short form platforms, including TikTok, Instagram Reels, Twitter, Facebook Reels, and YouTube Shorts. You can also have it go to Snapchat and Pinterest and LinkedIn and whatever other platforms that you want. However, the other thing that's going to happen is it's also going to be automatically turned into audio and that audio is going to be sent to all of the various podcast networks, including Apple Podcasts and Spotify and Google Podcasts and all of the various podcast networks. So if I were trying to generate leads and sales, essentially what's going to happen here is I'm going to create one video podcast. And from that, I'm going to get dozens of individual pieces of content and dozens of individual placements on all of these various platforms. And that's going to send traffic to my sales page or my squeeze page, or, you know, whatever it is that I'm using to generate leads or sales. And this can obviously be configured however you want. Obviously, you know, if your primary platform was TikTok, for example, you would post your videos on TikTok and then those TikTok videos would automatically get reposted to all of the other platforms as well. To me, this tool is not even optional. This is an absolute necessity if you're looking to create videos that are going to target the right audience, generate high quality leads, and so on. Essentially what the tool does is it scans my channel so it knows what my channel is about and it also scans my competitors and similar topics. And it's basically using AI to determine what are the best you know, video topics and so on. Because my channel generally talks about you know, AI and tools and tech and stuff like that, these are the topics that it's saying 
I should create videos about. Now, to be honest, this tool does a lot of really cool stuff. I don't have time to go over everything in this video, but I'm just gonna show you a couple of the main things that I use when I'm searching for video topics and ideas. If I wanna do a more specific search, I can come over to the keywords tab right here. I'm gonna click that. And let's just say I wanna create a video about AI tools. So I'm just gonna type in AI tools right here. And now I'm gonna come over here and click overall so that it sorts these keywords by the best opportunity keywords, meaning the keywords that are highlighted in green. So right off the bat, just taking a look at this, I would probably go with something like this, new AI tools. We can see this is getting searched 47,000 times per month, but still I could probably find something better. So what I'm gonna do is come back here and click where it says related keywords. And right off the bat here, I'm seeing some really good keywords. So if I were to make a video about Luma AI, we can see that there is low competition with this topic and there is 1.7 million people per month searching for information about Luma AI. Okay, so generally I'll start with this to figure out which keywords are in demand with relatively low competition. But the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over to this tab that says outliers. And so now if I were to just type in, we'll just go something broad, type in AI right here. And essentially this is gonna show me videos that are performing significantly better than that creator's channel average. So in other words, this video is performing 83 times better than this channel's average. And so now if I mix the keyword topic with this style of content, I would probably create a video something along the lines of Luma AI is the biggest thing since chat GPT. And then I would obviously watch this video and make my video somewhat similar to this video because we know that this this video is performing extraordinarily well in comparison to its channel average. So obviously I wanna create a video that is somewhat similar. So again, this tool does a lot of really cool stuff, but that is kind of the main, you know, basic workflow that I use when I am choosing video topics. This is the best tool by far when it comes to creating chatbots on, you know, platforms like Facebook Messenger Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, and other various platforms like that. And essentially what this allows you to do is automate your DMs on the various social platforms. But what it also allows you to do is create drip sequences very similar to that of an email campaign. For example, if I open this sequence right here, we can see that I have a drip sequence that basically sends out a message every two days or so. For example, this is one of the drip sequences that I've built into Telegram. And for people that subscribe to me on Telegram, it's essentially going to you know, follow up with them and give them little tips and so on. But the other cool thing is if I were to ask a question and say, hey, are you there? it's automatically going to respond and it's gonna offer me these additional resources. And so let's say somebody wants to contact me, they click the contact me button and now it says, okay, go ahead and type below, please be as detailed as possible, what's on your mind? And I'm just gonna say, how do I get more followers on TikTok? Okay, so now it's going to respond. And I should also mention that this drip sequence is for the OnlyFans creators that follow me on Telegram. It's gonna show them you know, different marketing tips and secrets related to OnlyFans. And so in this case, it's responding and it's saying, if you're looking to gain more followers on TikTok, the key is consistent engaging content that take away quality over quantity, focus on creating content that resonates with your audience. Remember building a strong personal brand is crucial for long-term success. If you want more tips and strategies, check out the Level Up Guide for in-depth insights on actionable steps. And then it's gonna offer a link to one of the courses that I offer right here. And so now people can go ahead and check out the course and potentially sign up from here if they want. All right, so hopefully you can see why this is so much more powerful than just you know setting up a basic email drip sequence or something like that. It's also gonna offer these additional options right here where they can ask another question, they can say that's all, they can access the main menu, or if they click this button right here, it will actually send me a notification so people can speak with me directly. This is something that a lot of businesses pay thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars you know, to VAs and assistants when this can essentially do all of that completely on autopilot without having to hire anybody. 
this is the tool that I use to create all of my landing pages and sales funnels. And this is what you want to use if you're selling your own software or a physical product or a coaching or a consulting or, you know, some kind of agency services. The first thing to understand is that there's a big difference between setting up a website versus setting up a sales funnel. A sales funnel is specifically optimized to increase conversions. And overall, a website is simply just not going to convert as many sales as you would if you had a proper sales funnel. So in this case, this is the funnel that I've created for the OnlyFans Level Up course. I've used almost all of the funnel builders out there, including ClickFunnels and Builderall and Kartra and everything else that you can imagine. However, this tool right here definitely has the most value. In fact, they give you a ton of stuff just on the free plan where a lot of the alternatives charge hundreds of dollars just to get, you know, the basic plan. And then if you want to, you know, move up, it's only $27 a month, which is extremely affordable. And again, after testing all of the alternatives, this is very equal to the platforms that are charging hundreds of dollars per month for the same thing. This is what I use to create my email newsletters. And so here's an example of one of the newsletters that I've created with this tool. And as you can see, it's a very similar style for those of you that subscribe to newsletters like Morning Brew and so on. And there's a million different reasons why this tool is the best when it comes to newsletters. I don't have time to go into every single thing, but trust the fact that this is the best platform when it comes to creating newsletters and monetizing newsletters. For example, one of the easiest ways to monetize is by simply recommending other newsletters. As you can see here, this one pays $1.60 for every subscriber that you send them. This one pays $2.40 for every subscriber that you send them. And so you can simply just recommend other similar newsletters to your own and get paid for every subscriber that ends up joining somebody else's you know, similar newsletter. On top of that, you can obviously monetize your newsletter in a million different ways through affiliate links and brand deals and so on. School is one of the newest and most popular uh, platforms for building communities and courses and things like that. This is one of the communities that I've set up. And if I were to go to, you know, the classroom, for example, we can see here's one of my free mini courses, which kind of goes into more detail about, you know, the strategy behind these tools and so on. If I were to open this up, we can see that I have a little mini course right here that kind of shows, you know, the strategy side. So if you're someone where you want to create your own community, you want to create your own course and stuff like that, this is a great platform to use. And obviously, if you want to join my free community on school. I will of course have the link for that down below as well. In any case, those are the primary tools that allow my tiny little, you know, channels to earn six figures is through these methods and through these tools. Hopefully you found that helpful and I'll see you in the next video.